like, well, this is the way it should be. And then they would just stop. They wouldn't go through. No. And I, who's I to say, Mark, not it. that I would know, but does margaritas really get people that drunk? I have no idea. Depends no. on the person. Depends. Depends. On yeah. Depends it's on very person. People have made poor decisions on Patron. Mm -hmm. right. Is that the same as a margarita? Isn't mm -hmm. that what goes in it? Don't tequila go I in the margarita? I don't know. I'm asking you. Remember, Tracy doesn't know anything about drinking. Yeah, you, you act like I know what you talk about. And I'm just like, what? I don't know. I don't mix drinks. So I literally, I'm the guy that I'd be like, literally, I drink, I drink an old fashioned. I drink a, a cranberry and vodka. I drink Red Bull and vodka, or I drink a dark lager for like a beer. Other than that, I'm the one who goes and I'm like, strike up a conversation with the bartender lady and be like, yo, give me something good that ain't too fruity. And, and whatever like, they put down, I drink. I don't got, I don't got, I don't got, <laughs> whatever they put down, down I, I drink. Don't, I don't drink liquor anymore. It, it's, but beer is liquor. Beer is no. not. No, beer is not. Wait a minute. Beer 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 is is very, do, how beer old do you have alcohol, to be to legally the drink? That you would say is beer is alcohol, liquor is alcohol. They're, they're, they're the same. Sir. I guess this is my no, second. no, 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 no. The difference between do you have to be twenty one to alcohol. drink? It? But yeah. do you have to be? 20? Well, it depends on where you are. But yeah, you have to be twenty one to get cigarettes. Yes, nineteen in Canada to get cigars. I don't know. I don't have never bought cigars. And then okay. a lot of kids, a lot of people start drinking in their teenage cigarettes years. Are not cigars. Yeah. So but they both it. have nicotine in them. No, it don't. <laughs> cigars do not have nicotine in it. Yeah, I know this is shocking people. Really? Cigars, cigars do not have nicotine. Yeah, that's what I they thought. They have tobacco. tobacco. They, have nickel. They, they don't have nicotine. Nicotine is a chemical for cigarettes. They don't have a chemical in cigars. Well, how come your doctor be saying what don't smoke cigars? Well, the reason they don't want you to smoke cigars is because cigars will give you throat and mouth cancer, but cigarettes will give you lung cancer. But what? So yeah. cigars, you don't actually take all the way into your lungs. At least you're not supposed to. Cigarettes is unless you Marlon get yeah. that look on his face. Unless you <laughs> me, so yeah, mm. yeah, well. I thought the the the, well, the stuff technical I don't... name of tobacco was like nicotine. That's what I thought. I'll put it to you this way: the only the only similarity between a cigar and the cigarettes is tobacco, but that's it. Anything else is totally different. Yeah, they're wrapped in a leaf. They're cigarettes are wrapped in paper, but cigars are wrapped in leaves. Right. Yeah. Now that much Unless I you get a cigarillo. A cigarillo is wrapped in paper, I think. With cigarillos are wrapped in like bubblegum wrap because them Beedies. things are cheap. Beaties are in eucalyptus. <laughs> they do you get cigarillos for like 50 cents. I'm like, y'all selling them like that? Yeah, they sell them like that because That's they know you're gonna terrible. take it back to your car or back to your apartment and you're gonna cut it open and you're gonna stuff it with weed. Liquor has like 40 to 50% alcohol beer has like 4%. Yeah. Yeah. There's the... That's why people can sit there and drink a whole six pack. Yeah. Um, I don't know how anybody that I, I, I'm like, they'll be like, man, because I work I work with a bunch of good old boys and stuff, and they, 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 they'll drink a whole, they'll be like, yeah, I drink six pack or whatever. I'm like, I can't drink that much liquid. Like, I just, I'll be I, tired I, I'll of drinking it by the second beer. beer. I don't want no more. I, I I read this before. When you drink enough alcohol, or when you get um, used to drinking enough alcohol, you're not in control anymore. So I know when you're saying when I can't drink that much anything, you're not in control anymore. So the alcohol is in control. So yes, you can drink me more and more and more and more. You're not in control anymore. You're, you're, you you're, are if it's beer. Beer, beer. I mean, I know you're feeding, you're feeding your addiction, right? So I guess, yeah. like you're saying, you're going to chase your tolerance level. But it's just I like when it. I drink beer, I drink beer. Now this is me because I'm not an alcoholic. But 
I drink beer as a social thing or just to like say I had something, right? Mm -hmm. So if I'm just social, then I can drink a beer. Mm -hmm. Not a light beer because it's like drinking nasty water. But I can drink a beer. If I just want some type of alcohol, but I don't have none around, I can grab a beer. But the most I can do is like two. After that, I don't want, I don't even want to taste it. It's bad enough. To, it's hard enough to get through the first one. Nope. And then you now, decide to have a second one? And you start off the because start it, off the takes two, it takes two. It takes two to crazy. feel the buzz. Yeah, apparently For me see, to feel any level of understand. buzz, I gotta get at least to the second beer. The first beer ain't gonna do nothing. I keep so, wondering how did I get to this age and say, "Who do you know what it tastes like?" Hey, say what? You gotta get to it. No, the second beer is the thing that got you to a buzz. Good for you. You're not a drinker. And good for I know, you, but I no, used to be a, a drink. No, I don't want nobody to think, oh, that's a shot at it. No. No, 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 I agree. Because, like, my progression with, with alcohol is an interesting thing. So in my family, there's, there's you know, history of alcoholism, which I guess in most mm -hmm. black families is probably some history of alcoholism. But anyway, in my family, it's only mm -hmm. one generation back, right? So I grew up in a household. Like I said, I grew up in the Cosby household. We ain't had the money. But no one cursed. We discussed and we got through things. The discipline and the expectations were very clear mm -hmm. and never saw my parents drink. I saw my dad drink one beer when I was probably like five or six years old um, and then never again. Okay. So that's the world I grew up in. And but I knew that the generation before me, like my grandfathers and stuff, they were really, you know, they, they got in it. So um, I went off to college. I was in college the first time I drank anything, right? Mm -hmm. Well, correction, I was around five or six when I took a sip of my dad's beer that one time, and it was so revolting. That right. In my head, I was like, if this is what alcohol tastes like, I don't want none of this. It's I didn't drink nothing. champagne, at, yeah, and I was like, really? Right? Like, I'm like, you want this? Why? <laughs> Right, I myself on mute because I have literally nothing to add to this conversation. Yeah. No, I got to college and I had, and that was the first time I tried to drink. I was like 18, and um, we got all the, the bottom shelf stuff, you know, Mad Dog, mm. wild, wild Irish Rose, like this rock, 245. what it's called. That's the only we one ain't I drink know. that. That's 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 malt liquor, we ain't, ain't do that, that's, but that's how, yeah. but we would. Oh, I mean, no, rate. malt liquor is disgusting. It's, it's, it's. No, I mean, it's more expensive and so. Yeah, but it's disgusting. Higher. That's malt that liquor, malt, that's liquor malted liquor beer. Well be that's liquor. disgusting. <laughs> malt liquor has the, the tendency of just wind up being just liquor. But I got a question for everybody. Um, if it's about quick. liquor, don't ask me because I'm be like, I'm not, I'm, I, I'm not, I am, but I'm not. Um, Tobacco. That's oh, the ingredients. Well, oh, okay. so I was trying to figure out, well, we still talking about the lady that was talking about abstinence and how the hell did we get on this subject? But I realized that she was talking about margarita, so that's how we wound up on this subject. So, yeah, for anybody that's new to the show, please keep up, because we will do this in a heartbeat. Sure will. We can change a subject like you have never seen before. Source plants. Uh, you, sounded like you sounded like Trump right there. <laughs> Oh dear. What? Like you've never seen before. Like oh. you've never seen before. It's everywhere. It's everybody. The people are it. saying, no, nobody's saying. The people are talking about and it's everywhere. You can find it anywhere on the internet if you go to like the 18th. People 18. are saying. People yeah. are saying. My people are saying. Mm -hmm. Their people are saying. I know some people who have. Okay. I just had to look that up because nicotine is in tobacco. It's tobacco. That's what. Yep, that's what I thought. Nicotine is in cigar. That's what I thought. It is a okay. Well, no. Cigars like cigarettes contain nicotine, a substance that can lead to a tobacco dependence. A single four yeah, five cigars the addictive part. nearly as much nicotine mm -hmm. as a pack of cigarettes. Oh, well, I ain't going to stop, so there you go. Wait, did they just compare have... a cigar to a pack of cigarettes? 
Yeah. Ooh. Yes, they did. Yes. Did, they did say doing hookah is like doing a whole pack of cigarettes. So doing a cigar makes sense. It's about half a pack. So they're mm -hmm. saying it's like it's a whole pack. Because I know mm -hmm. it's a lot more tobacco and nicotine you're pushing in your body. Um, It's just a different way of doing it. You know, it's beer <laughs> versus, uh, you know. Okay. We're now we're gonna, okay. No, go back to Parker's because now we're going to sound real stupid. What is shotgun? I hear this on a massive amount of liquor thing. I think shotgun in a beer is what? one of the top ten dumbest things ever. I'm asking what shotgun ever in ever. is. I ain't shotgun in Down shotgun. a lot. What? Just, like all in you, one. You just, so, uh -huh. right? so it's not something I've ever done, but I've seen some of my white friends do it. They, what you do is real quick, if this is what it is, you take yeah. a can of beer. Poke a hole in it with a pin or something, and you put that up against your mouth. Then you pop the top. The pressure forces the beer down, and you're supposed to just take it in as fast as you as, as you just take and it you in. Can cut your... That's okay. You can't cut yourself. You can't cut yourself. You can't cut yourself. Because when you poke, when you I mean, poke it's the just can, sounds... it goes inward. Uh, the point, Again, the point how am I it, supposed to know these things? But you can drink things. the beer within You're seconds not instead of like. Uh, yeah, like, the point of it is that you get the alcohol in you a lot quicker. That's the whole mentality of shotgun. A shot is it's not shotgun. Is a weed is a little different. A shot is this tall. That little bitty and, thing, the little bitty glass. And then, then yeah, you just, of, now the that I've, I've seen people do it. supposed to just shoot it back. Compared to a drink, yeah, like um, spill, um, just, uh, what do they call them? Pudding? No, no, not no, not pudding shots. Jello shots. A Jello shot, yeah. Oh, Something that's is, dangerous. Oh, so, yeah. <laughs> um, I'm a I'm a cheap drunk. I drink so seldom <laughs> that one minute drink sipping over a long period of time, and I'm smart. And, and believe it, believe it or not, yep. Some alcoholics, that is how they get their alcohol. They are cheap drunks. They would take a drink and they would sip it throughout the day. Unfortunately, mm -hmm. not throughout the day, sorry. Unfortunately, when I say they drink, they drink like... I say that's a functioning alcoholic. Uh, they drink for hours on end. We call right? that the Giuliani. Yeah. <laughs> that was my biological father, actually. And for most of my life... I had the the theist the I didn't ever see my parents beyond a little bit of champagne or something. Alcohol was not a part of our life. Yeah, see, that's where I'm at. I mean, I'm just like I'm trying to well, remember. Well, alcohol ever wasn't saw. part of my life because then my I grandfather, got because of the alcoholism on one side of my family. So mm. that was why they were so turned off to what like my dad grew up in the hood and and all that. So. They were so turned off from seeing how alcohol and um, chemical dependency can throw somebody yeah. off that mm -hmm. they wouldn't let anywhere near their kids. And, you know, and I, I'm a rule wow. follower. That's what I am. So I gosh, I was there like, are a lot of parallels. That's, that's really funny. There's Wait, a lot of Parker parallels just, between our family. Yeah. Did Parker just crack me in his mm. comments? I'm sorry? Well, I'm reading the I'm reading the comments. That LL, and that's more than Tracy has drank her whole drank her whole life. Drank, but drank. <laughs> drank. I'm pretty sure you said drank, but yes. Okay, Parker. Parker. Right, Don't Parker. make me pull up that video. I'll pull it up again. See, uh, I'm. But but I guarantee y'all, please do not smoke cigars because I just learned that it has a whole bunch of nicotine in it. Yeah, and as he's smoking his cigar, mm -hmm. 